Hey everyone, welcome back. So, if you will recall from last time, we have Vikings invading, so things are about to get very bad for us. Now, I have not experienced a Viking invasion until now, so I don't know exactly what's going to happen, but I can tell you with uh, almost absolute certainty that we are not ready, and we cannot stop them. The only defensive stuff I have is this. Well, it says it does... I thought that these only attacked, like, airborne enemies, so maybe this can work. But there's still all this open space for these Vikings to attack us, so I'm not... I don't know how well this is going to work. So let's just get ready for everything to go wrong, and let's unpause it. So here goes nothing. So while that's happening, you'll notice we have idle workers, but we don't have beds. And they're probably going to burn a bunch of our stuff down, so... Let's, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's put a cottage right there. And, uh, let's put another one... Let's just, let's just stuff everything. Oh, good, it's a... <laughs> it's a dragon and Vikings at the same time. Wow, thank you. Alright, so here are the Vikings. Oh, they're, oh, I, oh, oh, you gotta be kidding me, I thought there was... I only thought it was one ship, thank God I was wrong, right? There's only six of them. There's a frickin' gigantic thing. I don't know why the Vikings have, like, a troll or something. And here's some other Vikings. Here comes the dragon. Hey, we're firing at the dragon. That's good news, finally. Now, how about this one? Yeah, keep firing at that dragon. Come on, what good are you if y'all can't kill this thing? Kill that dragon before he burns everything to the ground. Come on. Oh, lucky for us, it's an immortal dragon or something. Okay, now here... Oh, alright, so they're shooting at that gigantic troll thing. The dragon still hasn't burned anything, so that's good. This troll's about to start eliminating everybody. But it looks like they're going to follow the road, so they will eventually run into that thing. We're still shooting the dragon, but it's not dead. And now here come the Vikings. Oh, shit. They're throwing... F oh, they're setting everything on fire. Well, this is where it all comes to an end, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the dragon's burning my fields over here. The Vikings are burning everything over here. Now he's going after my archer tower. Well, I guess the only thing we can do is just... The barracks isn't done. I mean, oh, shit. The only thing we can do is try to make another tower for future raids. Uh, looks like they're leaving. That's good. Where's that troll? Well, here's something over here. Good lord. Oh, good. They're up here, too. And so is the dragon. Look, everything is burning. And there's nothing I can do. The troll destroyed my archer tower. We still have this archer tower. And it's still shooting at vikings, but... And dragons. And ogre has destroyed a castle block. That's old news, everybody. That was a long time ago. It's an ogre, not a troll, and it, le it seems to be leaving. I hope it's leaving. Fire has claimed a charcoal maker. This dragon is still being shot at, but it's not being stopped. What is the good of these damn towers? Oh, it destroyed the one I was building. Oh, that's fantastic. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this sucks really badly. The Vikings are still here. We're still shooting at the dragon. Apparently the dragon just simply cannot be killed, so I don't know what the point of this is. I'm hoping that the Vikings are going to leave. That would be nice. So that we can try to assess all of the damage. Alright, what were... I don't even know what all was up here. I don't even remember. I think this was where our tower was. No, that was a stockpile. Okay, so we can replace that. This was the castle block, which proved to be completely ineffective, but whatever. I'm going to put another one down here, even though obviously this is just not working. I'm just going to put a lot of them, is what's going to happen now. Okay, where is... hopefully the dragon is gone. Hey, I think we just killed some Vikings. That's amazing. Okay, the Vikings seem to be leaving. Alright, so that was horrible. That was absolutely horrible. So there was a cottage here. Whoops. Okay, let's try to replace that cottage. What was here? Charcoal maker. Uh, 
That stockpile is still intact. That's good. These things... Don't see anything destroyed over there. I think... I think that was all that was destroyed, wasn't it? I think so. Okay, so we have... We have beds. Uh, we have idle workers. This... Uh, what is this? The Chamber of War. I really wish that would hurry up and finish. Alright. So, obviously we need to get on a war footing, or a defensive footing, or something. Everything else seems to be under control for the moment. Obviously our happiness went to hell because of the Viking attack, but look, we did drive the dragon away and we got plus ten. That's cool. Alright. So, the moat slows down invading ogres, but we don't have any space for a moat because I screwed it up. The barracks will turn villagers into typo soliders. <laughs> Soldiers wait here until a general recruits them, and we're going to get a general here. So we're going to have to... God, God, that thing is huge! Son of a bitch, that thing is huge. Come on, man. Uh, well... I guess we're just going to have to use up this decent land right here. My... Oh God, my planning is so terrible. I mean, this is the, my first game, so... I'm going to use that as an excuse to keep making bad decisions. We still have idle workers, despite all the stuff I have going on. As usual, we are always in need of wood. You'll notice each time I do this, we lose one of those idle workers. Because they are taking up this, this mission to go do this. Which means we must be stocked up on builders. Yeah, there's 8 of 8 here. So we have a lot of people building, and they're going to need jobs once they're done building. We've got fields that are flooding. Lots of fields are flooding. Oh, this is great. That's great. Alright, well it's time to put some more farms down. A terrible plague has swept the land. 33 peasants have taken ill. I have a hospital. Do I not? Plague doctor's ready to get to work. Okay, so go get to work, please. Here's all the people with the plague. Get down here and help them. Uh, as usual, when there's a storm, there's a fire. Because lightning apparently strikes our, our holdings every single time there's a storm. Oh my god, is this done? No, of course not. Alright, speed these up a little bit. We have one idle worker right now. Got that cottage going, even though we're not going to need beds anytime soon, because I guess a bunch of people died during the recent dragon slash viking invasion. We're going to have significantly less food this time, because all our damn fields are flooded, but it should be enough. Okay, Chamber of War is finally done. We can train a hero for 100 gold, and I'm obviously going to do that. Right down here, the barracks. Wow, that's already... Wow, it's already done. All right. So we're going to train a soldier. we got plenty of armaments. But we're going to be ready next time. We're going to be ready. All right. So I'm guessing by hero they mean general. Our peasants are miserable. Four have left the kingdom. Well, isn't that fantastic? All right, so I'm guessing that that is a hero. I'm guessing that's also a, a general. Whatever. I'm going to get a second one. Oh, look, another fire out of nowhere for no reason. Love those. We're not fully staffed here all of a sudden. We're going to make a second soldier. Clearly we need a well down here because... What the hell was that sound? Oh, that was a tree falling. Okay. Well, they took care of it before it burned down. Maybe we don't need a well there. Fields are looking good again. Happiness is just... Hopefully it's recovering now. We have ten idle workers. Okay. Wood is starting to look good. But we got idle workers. Might as well put a few to work here. Okay. So we've got two of these. People are still leaving because the happiness is low. That's great. We've got two soldiers. We're going to get a third soldier.
All right, what's new? Our food stores are running low. Well, that's, yeah. Peasants are miserable, of course. All right, so the food situation went poorly once again because of the rain. And so clearly we're going to need more fields and probably more orchards since the orchards are not affected. Yeah, we're running out of food. Where would be the best place then? Let's put it possibly... I think it has to be... Yeah, it has to be next to the road. So we're going to have to extend the road. So we're going to bring the road up this way to make it a little more easy. And let's see. Go ahead. Build those roads. Alright, so... I want to put an orchard blocked by existing... St oh, I put the road a little too far, didn't I? Ah, whatever. And we're going to put two orchards like that. And then on this extremely fertile place... Probably want to put... I've messed up my... Obviously, there's not enough space to do this again. I was going to do that here, but I ended up just screwing all that up. Because that's what I do. So I think, because we do have idle workers... We'll put this on this super fertile land. This is not super fertile. This is not fertile at all, but that's fine. And I'm still going to put a windmill right here. It should affect at least part of that orchard. I don't know if that'll count, but so be it. Um, let's see. What I'm going to do on that barren tile right there is I'm going to mo make another one of these pathetic archer towers, just in case we get invaded from this side. Okay, that reminds me, I need to put the towers... Ooh, ballista tower. High damage. Right, we're going to put that there. We've already got the archer there. And we're going to make that one a ballista when the time comes. Now what are you bitching about? Mm people starving, blah, blah, blah. I mean, they're not really starving. We do have food, but we do need this stuff to hurry the hell up. We have no idle workers, so that's new. Oh, look, another fire at the very same stockpile, or is this something else burning? It's, yeah, that's the stockpile burning, of course. So apparently stockpiles are incredibly prone to fires. I don't know why. Really don't know why. Alright, we're getting low on wood, and we're... We don't have a lot of workers. So, what the hell are we going to do about that? We've got the beds. I guess we just got to wait for peasants to show up. Alright, so we're going to speed this up, try to get our damn orchards going. Of course, we don't have any workers to work these fields right now because we don't have the peasants. Come on! We need be okay. There we go. Eleven people uh, showed up, so that's that's good. So we do have a couple fields, and oh, we do have all the fields occupied now. Almost, well, almost all of them. That's good. All right, and again, these are going to be really good because it's high soil fertility. That's plus four. That's very good. Oh look, not one second after we built this field, or well, you don't really build build one. You, I guess you like plow it or something, it burst into flames. Because as you know, soil is highly flammable. Um, we have three idle workers, so that means we can get some wood going again. So set that. Winter has arrived. It looks like we were able to get at least a little bit of food out of these other farms this time, so that's not too bad. The list of tower. All right, we need to cover the northern part here now. I think... I mean, obviously it would make more sense to make walls, but we're not going to do that. Like an actual wall to try and like block stuff off, but we're not going to do that. Because we made poor planning decisions. Okay, we have five people and we're going to be running short on beds again soon. Okay, so... 
let's put a cottage there. And we actually don't have enough wood to do another one. Wow, okay. Really surprised how quickly we're just burning through all the wood. Alright. Hopefully, we'll eventually start getting some... De I know we don't have idle workers right now, but... Alright, yeah, you, you people don't have, ever have anything nice to say. How are they starving? Oh, look, this ballista randomly burst into flames. Ah, oh, good God, people. Alright, looks like we took care of it. Now, what are these people bitching about up here? Oh, well, they've got everything taken care of up there, so they shouldn't be bitching. Over here, everything taken care of. Our happiness really should be fantastic, but it's not. Food shortage isn't helping, but anyway. Alright, we got seven new people. Now we have one idle worker, so we'll get some wood. Okay. Alright, what... What do we need? We still don't... What is this? Tools. Oh, why the hell are we not making the tools at the blacksmith shop? Oh, that's the baker. I don't even remember where I put the blacksmith. There it is. Currently producing armaments and tools. We've got all the armaments we need right now, so I'm going to have them focus on tools for the time being, because we really need to get that rock remover so that we can get access to this other stuff over here, the stone. This thing wasn't even built when it caught fire. Alright, plague is here again. But we've got plague doctors. Whoops, well there was one right there. You see them in the black. Alright, wood is flowing nicely now. We have tons of idle workers. Hmm. They're just constantly bitching about, okay, we're out of food. How are we out of food? My God, people. What do you want from me? Well, clearly, we have to do more farms. But we have to have a road that... Ah, crap. So we put that road there. That's not close. Ugh, give me a break. That's not close enough for the... Give me a damn break, I swear to God. I'm not choosing the best places to set the stuff up, but I'm just... Hmm. I'm an idiot. Starving? Hmm. Yeah, they're not starving right now. We have plenty of food right now. Okay. Four peasants have left because they're miserable. Yeah, well, it's their loss. Okay, so looking up here... Can we make another farm there? Probably so. We have idle workers. Not a big deal. Alright, that's cool. You know what? This wasn't this... Oh, it wasn't barren, but I couldn't select it. But now I can. Alright. Now, this is barren, but so be it. All right, I'll be damned if we're going to run out of food again. This is ridiculous. All right, so that's... That should be fine there. I mean, theoretically, could put some farms there, but eh. All right, we got 11 more people. That's very good. All right, so what I'm going to do is extend this road back behind these buildings. Like so, and then reconnect over here. And we got some decent farmland right ooh, and right there. But we don't have a don't really have the three by threes except over here. Alright, so let's wait for them to finish that road before we continue expanding. Look at all this food. Don't even try and tell me we're not gonna be having a having enough food here. Okay, available for pickup. Blacksmith is producing tools finally, so we got two of them. 
We need tin to make the rock removal place. Hmm. Our food stores are running low. How in God's name? All right. And we have granaries here. I mean, that can't... The storage is not the pro... Oops, over here. Storage is not the problem. All right, that ballista's done. We're out of beds once again. Uh-huh. All right, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to put a manor on this barren land. I'm going to put another one... Yeah, I'm just going to waste that land right there. Okay, so for here, a, a closer granary might be a decent idea. Could put it on that barren land. That's what we'll do. Whoops. Alright. Now, okay, so, alright, wood situation, as usual, is problematic. I think it might be... got seven people. I wonder if it'd be quicker to cut this wood. I don't know. I mean, we got a forester here, I mean, so we might as well. Food coming in, it better be a shitload. How they use it so quickly. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. And they're also, or as always, bitching about the food. I am, I'm well aware that that's a problem. I can put it on max speed for a second. I'm waiting for these manners to finish. Oh lord, dragon. And it's coming from this way. Good thing I have this ballista here. We have that archer tower. I don't know if any of this is going to be enough. This could be bad. Alright, shoot him. Shoot him, you bastards. Shoot him. There we go. That could not have felt good. This one can't reach him. Is he out of the blister? Oh, he's out of range now. He's he's free to do whatever he wants. Oh, man, I hate this so much. Move within range of my archers or somebody. There we go. There we go. Hit him. There we go. Come on. Do not let him burn down these damn manors. They're not even built yet. Come on. Shoot him. Okay, I think he's out of range now, so he's just having a good old time. Well, at least this tells me where I need to put stuff. Let's find a barren slot right there. Okay. Oh, uh, come on. They're shooting him, that's one thing. I guess we'll have to make another one right up there. Now he's going to come towards this ballista. Yes, hit him. Awesome. So you notice he hasn't set anything on fire, so that's that's good. Shoot him. Now I would have had another one down here, but that ogre destroyed it, so... It looks like that was a foolish move. He's going to go anywhere he can where he's not going to get shot, I guess. And he's going to burn my forester down. Well, it's good to know that we can fill the dragon full of arrows and ballista uh, bolts or whatever, and he, it just doesn't matter. All right, now he's coming back into range of the ballista. Hit him. Hit him again, please. Oh, it's so slow. Now we're back in range of our archers. I mean, really, people, what does it take? I think he's leaving, finally. Yes, I do think he's finally leaving. That is great. I'm going to make this an archer tower. And when this one finishes... Oh, hell, we'll make that one a ballista.
That'll be an archer tower right here. Hold on. I don't have idle workers, so that's not good. Because I don't have beds, because the manors aren't done. Let's speed that up just a bit. Well, we were able to save the, the forester from burning down, so... All in all, that dragon attack was not the worst experience. So we can be thankful for that. I really need my housing to finish. I know I could free up workers to make it go more quickly. 21 people, but no one stayed because they couldn't find homes. Because the manors were not done. Oh, man. Okay. What was I going to put here? A ballista or archers? I'm going to put ballista. Alright. And then let's put that there. And then there was one up here, which I am putting the archers. Okay, so I think that was all of those. Alright, food coming in. I really need these manors to finish building. And of course that won't be enough even when they're done. I mean, before long, so... We're going to put some hovels in. Wherever we've got some barren land seems like a, a decent idea. Like so. Alright, is this done? That is done. Alright, so that can hold 25 residents. That's very good. So we have 20, 256 beds ready. Hmm. They worry about food for the winter. Hmm. I don't care. The peasants think you're an excellent ruler. Well, that's a change. Hmm. Haha, ha, that dragon will think twice for heading this way again. So I guess we got a happiness boost again, yep, for driving the dragon away. Okay. Oh, man, where'd all the tools go? I get, They're obviously being used by someone, or maybe they're in a stockpot. No, they're gone. Tools are used to speed production and remove... Oh, okay, speed production. So maybe that's why... Damn it. I put armor back. They need charcoal. Why are we not getting charcoal? Oh, I don't, well, we're certainly low on wood, but we got idle workers. Let's make it happen, please. Okay, and I'm going to... we got lots of stockpiles down here, but I'm going to... Of course, I can't make a big one yet. But I want to make another one. Even though we've got, like, three right here. Come on. Oh shit, we've become a bustling city. Alright. Okay, anyway. So I wanted to make another stockpile that they can get to real quickly after chopping wood. And that should do it. Alright. People have joined us. We have plenty of beds available now, thanks to the manors and the hovels. We've got wells at most of these places. This is close to the water, may not need a well. Um, okay. Might as well get a third hero. Per Christian Brawstad has died of old age. I don't even know who that was. And then down here, we have only two soldiers. We have a bunch of stored armaments, so I need to use them up. Waiting for trainee arrival. Okay, cool, cool. Now, they only have that one archer tower here, right? Oh, there's a castle block right there. Okay, I was thinking that there was something else, and there was. So, ballista tower, right there. Okay. Again, I wish I could just click and drag on these trees. It'd be so much easier. Alright, good. Now. Food situation should be pretty decent by now. So I'm not incredibly worried about that. Um, might need, oh no, I already put a granary right here. Yeah, so, I would like to do, again, the rock removal, but I, I don't know exactly how we're going to save up to get those damn tools. 
Uh, so be it. Alright, so we managed to survive a dragon attack and a viking attack at the same time, and then a second dragon attack, so that was kind of impressive if I do say so myself. We're still having lots of, well, not lots, but every now and again when a, you know disaster strikes, we're having food issues. So I'd really like to get that under control. But that looks like where we're going to leave it for today. I'm sorry I don't have another cliffhanger for you. But I'm sure I'm probably going to get a notice about Vikings invading here in just a second while I'm finishing these things up. Hopefully not, actually, because I don't want that. Uh, but yeah, so let's get a quick look here. That This is what we've got so far. Uh, it's going to be time to spread... Oh, good, a fire at one of my orchards. It's going to be time to spread... Well, where are we going next? There's a lot of barren land over here. We're probably spreading in this direction next. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. Thank you, everybody, for joining me. I always appreciate it. And, uh, why are people not staying? Look at my happiness, it's fine. But yeah, so thanks for watching, hit the like button if you enjoyed this, leave a comment, tell me what I'm doing wrong, or tell me why I'm stupid, and we will see you next time.